So, P0455. Let's talk about what this code means. P0455 is an evaporative emission control system leak. This is a large leak. So, the EVAP system helps to keep everything sealed. It helps to keep gasoline vapors from escaping. This is important because these vapors release hydrocarbons. What are hydrocarbons? Well, they're bad. Greenhouse gas is bad. If that wasn't bad enough, you're also leaking fuel and therefore money. So you're literally leaking money. The emphasis here is on vapors. You're familiar with gasoline as a liquid, but it actually evaporates quickly and we need a way to catch and use all those gases. Your EVAP's inability to keep those gases in is what's causing this error code. So what exactly is the EVAP system? Let's draw it out. This is the EVAP system, which specifically deals with the vapors of the fuel system. First, the gasoline has to enter the fuel tank through the filler neck. This is sealed tightly, or should be, with the gas cap. Once in the fuel tank, the vapors are regulated by the vapor control valve. Once the vapor is released, it enters the evaporation emission canister. And this is where things get interesting. The canister has something called activated charcoal. It's scary. It's a really dry. That acts as a sponge to store the fuel vapors. At the right time, the evap canister purge valve opens and uses the vacuum from the engine to draw just the right amount of fuel vapors out of the charcoal and into the intake manifold. From there, the engine draws the mixture of air and fuel vapors into the cylinders, which looks a lot like this other video. So now that you understand the system, you understand what P0455 means and what a large leak in the EVAP system will lead to, a decrease in fuel economy and harmful gases released to the atmosphere. In fact, these errors account for 20% of pollution caused by a vehicle. Come on, son! The good news is that the majority of the time, this is due to a loose, missing, or damaged gas cap. But in the case of P0455, it could also be a faulty or stuck vent control valve, a faulty or stuck purge valve, a cracked or damaged evap hose, or a cracked or damaged charcoal canister. Make sure to check out the blog for more detailed information. And thanks again for watching. Click subscribe for more content and comment below on what you would like to see in the future. Happy driving, everyone.